Today, a very unfortunate incident happened in Dosdawa Khasi village under Patiala Sapit, beside the GP, where the indigenous tribal forest dwellers of Khasi Punji plantations were destroyed by the forest department. It is unfortunate because it is a discriminatory act where their livelihood should be preserved, they should be protected under the Forest Act of 2005. But the, today's incident shows that in the name of eviction, certain group of people are trying to destroy the constitutional rights of these people. So many rich fellows have plantation encroached in different parts of the reserve forest, but no actions were taken against them. Because they are rich, this eviction drive, which I believe is supposed to be against the encroachers, my question to the Honorable Forest Minister, to the Honorable Chief Minister of Assam, so why is this happening to the forest dwellers Whereas, it should have been done to the illegal encroachers. We urge the Chief Minister of Assam, the Forest Minister of Assam, to kindly look into the fate of these people who are struggling for their survival in the state forest with legal documents from the of government of Assam, recognizing them as forest dwellers. I urge the Chief Minister's office and the Forest Minister to kindly uh, take immediate and necessary action to protect the livelihood of these forest dwellers and evict all the illegal encroachers with hope and firm belief under the able leadership of our Honorable Chief Minister Sri Dr. Himanta Bisha Sharma, our Forest Minister Sri Parimal Suklobaida. I hope justice prevails for us indigenous tribal people living here in Dosdava Khasipunji as well as in other parts of Assam, we would also like to request the government of Assam kindly and look into the fate of all indigenous tribal people by ensuring that eviction by illegal encroachers is done immediately and then demand. As a community, we feel very upset to hear this kind of news that our people, livelihood, should be cut down and demand our needs. What we have done was the forest department that they have to come and cut down our, our livelihood. These all the children, what they will eat now? We request and strongly demand immediate compensation to be there for these poor families. We should be the victim of this eviction order. This is our demand. We as a student union, JSU, we visit today in the sport. After seeing and visiting the place, we feel very bad seeing the uh, forest department, the way they with our people living here in this village. So from KSU, we strongly condemn the forest department for doing all this to our people, destroying their poverty. This is only the way where they can get their livelihood, they can feed the children. So if the forest department continue like this, we from KSU will not stay quiet. Yeah, ask about me. It's happening for many decades. Yeah, jal band hona hai. Or DOPO, I am I'm, I'm giving warning to DOPO particularly from my organization. So Mr. DOPO, you please stop your all illegal activities. Otherwise, otherwise you will face so many consequences as per law of the land. So we are going to file a case if necessary in what you honorable like court. Even Supreme Court also we are going to file a case in for our safety and security and protection and preservation of our identity, culture, tradition, language, everything. Here the forest department, we want to say that the forest Bangladeshi local forest dweller ni oke, ulog rare ay yaha more than one thousand. This is area me. So unlo ka to kuch ye ho raha. Ulta ulta bol government ka order hai. Order dikhao kaha order apka. For you you should have to know very clear that what is forest right act, this what is the forest uh, uh, forest light of uh, this uh, forest law of Assam and the SC SC Associated Act. Apko apko sarma na chahiye. At DOPO, okay, you should know better. On my behalf, I am requesting to this Honorable CM again from here, uh, please do something for our indigenous tribal people out there in Barakbili.